So, this is the illustrious Incredible World, huh? Impressive. And better yet, there's no one around to see me. Now, let's jump the fence. It's one small step for man and one giant leap for no! Oh. Oh. oh, that was not cool, Millard. Oh, 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 oh. What is that? It must be my cell phone. My cell phone's gone. It must be in my backpack. My backpack's gone too. I know it came off when I jumped the fence. Oh, it's Mr. Romano. Hello? I thought you were never going to answer the phone. What took you so long? Uh, technical difficulties, sir. But uh, remember, we're supposed to use our code names. I'm Yellow Jacket, and you're Bumblebee. Forget the silly code names. You watch too much TV. So, did you get in? Yes. I jumped the fence. So what's it like? What's the fence like? No. <laughs> what's the park like? Is it as incredible as they say? Well, I have to admit, sir, it does look very nice. The landscaping is well manicured, and the buildings are bright and colorful, and everything seems so... All right, that's enough. I get the picture. Okay, you know what to do, right? Yes, sir. You can count on me. There's no way they're going to win that World's Best Theme Park Award this year. Well, they better not, or you're going to be scraping gum off the pavement for the rest of your life. That title belongs to us, Big Thrill Theme Park, and I don't intend to share it with anyone. Do I make myself clear? <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, you make yourself very clear. Good. Don't fail me. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Can I help you find something? Uh, no. I was just looking for my, uh, uh, cell phone, and uh, here it is. Well, I'm delighted you found it. You know, I don't believe we've met. My name is Mr. Peterson. I'm the park director. Park director? That's right. And what's your name? It's uh, Grover. Uh, Millard Grover. Well, Millard Grover, do you mind if I ask why you're late? Late? You missed the staff meeting. Staff meeting? They didn't tell you about the daily staff meeting? Oh, of course. The daily staff meeting. Uh, so it's a daily, is it? Yes, and that means every day. Right. I'll need to make a note of that. Good. Now, I suggest you get into your uniform right away. The park opens in one hour. Uh, yes, Mr. Uh, Peterson. Peterson. Uh, yes, Mr. Peterson. <laughs> uh, Millard. The employee lockers are that way. There's a sign on the door that says employees only. Oh, of course. I just got turned around. Uh, thank you, Mr. Peterson. Uh, it was nice to meet you, Mr. Peterson. He better not be working the sky ride today. That's all I can say. Good morning, Mr. Peterson. Good morning, Miss Ryan. How are you today? I'm fine, sir. Guess what? We just received a call from Adventure TV. Really? What did they want? Well, they want to come visit the park and needed to speak with you. Well, I told them you'd return their call as soon as possible. Um, Adventure TV coming to Incredi World? That's kind of a big deal, isn't it? 
Okay, I'll call them as soon as I get back. I just need to speak with the guys here first. What's wrong? I, I just don't trust them. I mean, they always seem to have something up their sleeve. Who? Uh, Gabe and Cody? Yeah, Gabe and Cody. I had no idea you felt that way. Do you want me to say something to them? No, that's all right. I'm a big girl. I can handle it. Well, as you can see, there's nothing to worry about because they're not even around. <laughs> see, that's what I'm talking about. All right, time to stop playing with the sound effects. When are they ever going to grow up? <laughs> That's okay, Miss Ryan. We'll let the extreme team do that. Good idea. Sorry, we just got this incredible new animal sound library, and we had to try it out on someone. Of course you did. That elephant is awesome. What's wrong, Miss Ryan? Why are you hiding? I'm just keeping a safe distance. I never know what might be flying or crawling or slithering around either of you. What's that you're eating? Mealworms. Ew. See what I mean? They're not bad. Really. You want to try oh, some? Disgusting. You're kidding, right? No, look. You want some? They're very nutritious. <laughs> I'd rather take a vitamin. I'll take some. Sure, help yourself. Oh man, you took all the big juicy ones. Sorry. That's okay. Mmm, mmm, delicious. See, you sure mm. you don't want any? I think I'm gonna be sick. I guess we should talk about something else. Mm. Hey, are we still on for staff devotions tomorrow? Yes, as a matter of fact, that's why I came over here in the first place. I wanted to make sure you remembered. So have you decided what you're gonna do yet? Well, we thought we'd do a couple creature features, since that is our specialty. Great, I was hoping you'd say that, since most of the staff doesn't get to see your show. I know, it's just that the hard part is deciding which ones to do. It doesn't matter. They're all fascinating, if you ask me. Every time I watch one of your shows and learn about some animal, I am just amazed at the handiwork of God. I know. Isn't it incredible? You mean, isn't he incredible? How anyone can think that it all just happened by chance is totally beyond me. It doesn't make any sense at all, and it's not even good science. And yet they teach evolution and millions of years like it's a fact, when really it's just a belief. I think it's terrible. Yeah, a terrible lie. Mm -hmm. And that's why we need places like Incrediworld, so people can have another opportunity to hear the truth. Yeah. But always remember, even with all the evidence of design we see in these creatures, the very best evidence for creation is the Bible. That's right. And the Bible tells us that God created everything in six short days. Not that millions and billions of years thing. Amen, brother. Well, I better get going. I've got to make an important phone call. Oh, Adventure TV called this morning. They want to come to Incrediworld. <gasps> really? Adventure TV? That's kind of a big deal. Uh, so what do they want to do? I don't know. I've got to call them back to find out. Do you think maybe they'd film our show? Well, I suppose that's possible. You mean we might be on TV? I better watch this shirt. Ooh, good idea, Cody. Hey, hey, do they still do that uh, award thingy? You mean the world's best theme park award? Yes, they do. Hey, didn't we uh, win that last year? Come on, Gabe. We've won that the last three years in a row. You know, it's a real honor winning that award, considering all the other great theme parks. But best of all, it gives us an opportunity for our message. I'll let you know what's going on as soon as I find out, okay? And in the meantime, let's be sure we're at the top of our game. First impressions are very important. That's right. Come on, Gabe. We've got work to do. Oh, I'm right behind you. Wow. This is exciting. So... Adventure TV is coming to Incrediworld, huh? That's perfect. We'll just have to welcome them, won't we? 